you, you talk about uh, energy a lot. Yeah. And uh, are you religious or do you believe in energies or what? Do you have any beliefs at all for, for both of you? Well, I would say, what, do you want to go first? Um, you, to me, it's all, it all goes down to the vibration of music. Yeah, you've, you're probably more qualified to talk on that. Than, than Am I? I? No, well, I'm just... Yeah, but you were going to say something. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tricky one. Um, there's too many, like I mentioned diversity, there's too many amazing things in the world that we're, we're all yet to discover that we don't know about yet. Um, and I think remaining open-minded but not being fixed in one thing is really important because like I said you can go down an alleyway and then go and become so closed off I would say that certainly for me my drug my re my religion is music um, and it comes down to good old-fashioned kindness that, that that's that's my philosophy that you feel the same way too mm. um, just completely burying yourself in the music is so important uh, and turning you know even you get you wake up in the morning I feel like crap let's turn that into a piece of music let's turn anguish into beauty you know yeah. or, or, mm. or think about something that's going on in the world and then write a beautiful piece of music that represents something of that that's what that's what we're for I think mm. um, yeah, I think it would be arrogant to say I'm qualified in this, in this you know, um, but you know, I think that there's just too many new things to discover to go, well, I'm just this and I'm just that. I think who knows what the next couple of albums are going to be. I think they're going to be damn good, but I don't know what they're going to be. <laughs> but got, we know. What, I've got some ideas. Yeah, well, so do I. No, but we know what we like. Um, yeah. And uh, actually, do you know what, though, just on an off point, one of the things that's always scared me is passing on one day and not hearing absolutely everything that I can, you know, knowing that I'll pass on one day and I wouldn't have heard something beautiful. That's something as well that sort of scares me a bit, really. And that's kind of something that we like to sort of think about philosophically. You know what I mean? Yeah. Sort of, I, I don't want to miss anything. I don't want to miss anything amazing. But I know, obviously, there'll come a point where hopefully I'll be over 100. Hopefully you'll be over 100. Um, but we don't want to miss out, you know. We want to hear everything amazing from mm. people. Well, that's good, yeah. <laughs> do, do you believe in life after death? I... I'm in love with the mystery of it. Right. I think it would be... I go back to ego. I think it would be arrogant to have a hard and fast idea if, if I don't have proof, but I have an intrigue. And I think beauty is in the mystery. Um, but I know that I'll find out one day. I'll either not know anything. There'll either be nothing or there'll be something. Yeah. But I know that there's something now. So if I'm here now, why wouldn't I be before or after? That's a question. I have questions rather than answers for it. What do you mm. think? Yeah, I, I, I couldn't really answer. I can't you, really have, answer. you can be a right sceptic, though. You can, I can. You can really... Yeah drain it out and I think, oh, I've really <laughs> lost my, my poeticness on it. But I, no, 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 I, no, I'm being mean. I'm being mean. No, but I think that it's good to have a healthy, you know, I think it's good mm. to challenge things because I think it's too easy to sort of get lost in a pretty picture of, oh, yeah, you know. I think I subscribe more to the sort of Russell Crowe in Gladiator thing. What's of, that? Um, you know, every, everything you do in life will echo throughout eternity. Well, like, sort of more, more into that, maybe. I don't know. Well, it goes back to the, the, you know, treating somebody like you want, you want to be treated yourself. Yeah, is that, is that go with the kind of karma thing? Or? I believe I in karma, suppose, big time. I, I believe in karma, I tell you. But, 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 you know, you do something nasty, it'll come back to you. Definitely. Where, where do those kind of beliefs stem from? My conscience. Oh, right, so you know, it always kind of felt like yeah. it was there. Yeah, yeah, like an awareness and, and working with the conscience, I think. What do you think? I just don't want to sound cliche. <laughs> I mean, it's your thoughts, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just, just now, I've, I've got a stream of conscience. But I think like... we subscribe to Christian values, generally, you know. <clears throat> yeah, generally but speaking. But again, looking out to the beauty in all, in, all, in all areas of the world, you know, and... I mean, we don't travel very often, but when we do travel to different countries, going to see historical sites to, to really understand what was of, of the people of the time, um, 
I think you can have good values of what you were brought up on, but then branch out and see all beauty because there's absolutely beauty in, in everything. You've just got to look for it, don't you think? Absolutely. Sound very positive. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, we have our down <laughs> days. Don't get, don't, you know, <laughs> but hopefully there'll be less of them if you, if you work on it, you know. Yeah. Hmm. Um, uh, do you believe in God or higher being? I would like to say so. Um, oh. And I think it works with the music as well, because what do the Eskimos always say? The art's in the paper. You just need to bring it out. I definitely think so. Uh, because it's t there's too much meaning for it to not have some higher purpose, surely. Um, mm. Yeah, I, I think so. Um, well, it's like tonight. I, I was, you were freaking out in the car because of this absolutely dreadful accident. I said, I'm telling you, you've got to generate positive thoughts. There's going to be something good that's going to come out of this. We will get there. Nobody will be upset with us because we won't be later than 6.30. And something will happen. And then you had another session that cancelled. What I, what I would say, though, is I definitely think it can be a good thing to believe in God. I, that's, I, I think to be that's, humble when you really, you know... But, 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 but I, I think, actually, just as a way of living life, as a, as, a, um, as a help, actually, I think it can be a very good thing. As a help, but it I think there's another... It can But there's another skill to that as well. That it, You know, a lot of people go, well, I prayed for that, and it didn't come to me, so I don't believe in it. Well, mm, it's not just about you. Um, you know... If you've got friends that are going through things, they, they come to you, they confide in you with something. It's your duty to look out for them, to give them a thought, give them positive thought or a prayer, whatever you want to call it. Mm. But we have a duty to each other. And I think a lot of it can be sort of mistaken for selfish, own selfish needs. Do you know what I mean? And I think that it's, it's hard work. Well, it's not hard work because it should, you should learn to want to do it and to do good for others. But I think, you know, when praying or really needing something or asking for something from a higher force, don't just talk about yourself all the time. Talk about the people around you that need something. Mm. And maybe you might get what you need, but it's not... What, and I say what you need, not what you want, because a lot of people, you know, well, I want this. Well, it might not be what you actually need. Um, there's a difference. There there's is. a big, big <laughs> difference. Is, yeah. yeah, so I think responsibility, I think, with prayer in any form that somebody wants to do is a, is a responsibility not, in, not only to yourself but to the others around you. And it goes to community, it goes to your friends, your family, everything. Mm. You know, to not just take what you want to, to, but to, to give others what they need as well. And it will, I think, make a big difference. Yeah.